What is good everybody, I'm Kirby1 and welcome back to Pokemon Legends Arceus. I do ask that if you are enjoying the series so far that you please hit that subscribe button. Um, it really helps out the channel and I do really appreciate it. So, last time we were here, I was uh, just freezing my nuts off, hanging out, but also went up to Mount Coronet first. The, I guess not exactly to Mount Coronet, but to the Coronet Highlands, where we... Uh, had to go to the Moon View Arena, where Cresselia has uh, was sitting, hanging out, um, taking up space. Made Electro go into hiding, actually, or supposedly hiding the bush, warm up in the bush, um, disturbing the peace there. So we had to go uh, battle and collect a plate from Cresselia there. Captured her, got the Dread Plate, which allows certain Pokemon to access the dark type if you don't know what certain Pokemon that is it is Arceus um, and then after that oh we can read the text on all these the power of defeated giants infuses this plate they all say the same thing the rightful bearer of a plate draws from the plate it holds the power of, uh, powers of plates are shared among Pokemon the rules of time and space change within the opposite world. When the universe was created, its shards became this plate. The original one breathed alone before the universe came. Where all creation was born, that is the being's place of origin. The third being raged, raining down bolts of anger. I don't think these are in order. Now I just messed up ones I've already read and ones I haven't. The rift is born of disorder on the other side of this world. Does this make sense? The rightful bearer of the plate draws from the plate it holds. Third being raged, raining down bolts of anger. The third plate? Two beings of time and space set free from the original one. I think I read this one. That which fills the other side of the world can shape the rage and mold it. Two make matter and three make spirit, shaping the world. Two make matter and three make spirit, so that's the three lake Pokemon and then Palkia and Dialga. Three beings were born to bind time and space. That's gotta be the three lake spirits. It gathers power from the plates, listening to the flute song. Where all creation was born, that is the being's place of origin. When the universe was created, it shards. I think I read all these. The being poured the remains of its power into stone and buried it deep. So I don't know if those are in the correct order or those are just organized in an order in my inventory. But uh, yeah. There's that. Sorry, I got sidetracked with the plates there. Got the dread plate and then what else we do? We come to the Alabaster Icelands because we got done with Chrysalia's uh, mission fairly quickly. Ended pretty pretty quick there's a braviary up there wonder if I can catch it better by going to the top of the top of the temple maybe can I just climb the temple on the outside nope unfortunately cannot cheat the system that way but um sidetrack there's a wisp so come to the Alabaster Icelands thinking, well, I guess I've got to do two plates this video. But uh, then actually went and did the treasure quest from Irida. It was similar to the Adamant's, uh, Adamant's treasure quest. Where just before we get the, what's basically the lustrous orb. Unless that's what it's called in this game too. The... Lustrous globe. 
same thing, really. Um, yeah, we got that from her doing her treasure mission, which yeah, was basically the same thing. And we uh, collect it, so now we can change Palkia's form to and from the origin form. So we did that, and then that was, you know, still not exactly my typical ending time, but it was time enough to warrant the ending point, and now we're doing the uh, snow temple plates. A plate. One singular plate. Let's see if I can't catch this guy. No, 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 you, you don't know. You don't know. I'm not here. You like crunchy salt? It don't seem that you do. No, it was just maybe too far away. How about orange berries? Everyone likes a good orange berry. Whoa, boom! Gigaton ball, go! Nice. Even an effective method on non-alphas, I'll have you know. Orange berries are loved by all Pokemon. It's just easier to carry around a bunch of orange berries, but you can make the specific cakes that every Pokemon likes. Like you can make, since these Pokemon like the crunchy salt, you could make a crunchy salt cake. But if you just collect up enough orange berries, it does the same thing. Oh yeah, I remember this. I think there was a wisp down here or something, wasn't there? This was the door that I couldn't access, couldn't open. This looks like a red red gigas, doesn't it? Oh, wouldn't have expected to run into you up here, Kirby. What are you up to? You're here to try and find the secrets lurking in Snowpoint Temple, aren't you? That's what my clairvoyance told me. You do tend to get mixed up in all kinds of strange going-ons, Kirby. This door here, well, they say behind it sleeps a Pokemon so great it could tow around the entirety of the continents that lie to the south. No matter what we do, this door just won't seem to open. Until today. The stone plate, iron plate, and icicle plate you're carrying are reacting to the door. Oh. Uh -huh -huh. The stone, the, st I, the stone, the iron, and the icicle plate, or the ice plate. Those sound like three types of Reggies that I gotta fight. That's a dead end. This is not a dead end. Why do they have a little, like, dead end here? What is the point? What is the point, architect of temple? Oh, that's not a welcoming sight at all. Glealy. The Graveler. The Glealy looks fucking huge. Oh fuck, I just, <laughs> I just fucking smacked it on the fucking noggin. Yeah. Bonk. Okay, that's good too. That's not great. Yeah, avoid that attack. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, let's try this again. Don't dodge it this time. Thank you. Down you go. Oh, you 
double edge, you son of a bitch. He's a strong style leaf blade. Or the back of my head, that works too. Got some grit gravel and some grit dust. That's pretty good. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Yeah, come up here. Yeah. Yeah. And run away. That's right. Nope. How about okay? Look at that. Yeah, How about that? Does that fix your curiosity? Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Decided to get in the ball. Second one did after a little more convincing. Ooh, that is a Reggie Regigigas. What is best for dealing with you? I wonder if it's not Torterra. It might not be. Not entirely 100% convinced. Definitely not Terminator, because they're all, they all got, well, I guess not all of them have rock type, or they all rock type, and then a dual type if you're not Reggie Rock. I think the global warming's got to be the way to go, GW. What, what, in, what in time is that thing? It's colossal. It sure seems to be a Pokemon, but let's see what my clairvoyance has to say. Yep, definitely a Pokemon. My clairvoyance showed me a vision of it in motion. Motion. Motion of the Regigigas Ocean. This is all the Regis combined, right? Or is this just an entirely different Pokemon and you need to... You need the three... Typically, you need the other three Regis in order to summon this Regigigas. Well, it is not GW. Does anyone else have anything good? Fighting. Ghost has no effects. Is it a normal type and rock type? That doesn't seem right. Does it? Nothing super exact. Super acceptable. Super effective except Gawain's fighting type. I don't know if that's the right move or not here. Dragon Impact. Good job, GW. Avoid it. Well, we'll just see what else it has for us. No, you didn't dodge it. We can get away with an oops, we can get away with an agile style. Leaf blade. Yeah. And go Ultra Ball. Get this Regigigas. Come on now. Just get in the dang ball. That's what we like to hear. Thank you for cooperating. Some well valued experience points for the for the team. We got the blank plate. We'll access the normal type. Makes sense. Makes sense. 
Now that was one solid Pokemon, like a giant born of the very earth. I guess this is just part of your job with the Survey Corps, huh? What kind of Pokemon is the one you just caught, Kirby? Hmm? I can't wait to see in the Pokedex when it's done. Yeah, I'm pretty curious to read everything Mr. Professor writes up, too. See you, Kirby. We should do another chase sometime. Plate of Stone Point Temple. Well, that's all the plates, so now it's in store for us. We have to go back to Kogita. Oh, yeah, head back to her retreat, seeking the remaining plates. There's more. Or have we sought the remaining plates? I don't know. How many types are there? How many Pokemon types are there, huh? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Five in a row. 15, 16. Are there 16 types here? What do I got? I got 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12 on my team. So no other Reggies are around? Just Reggie Gigas? Very interesting. Very interesting going on here. Let's just yeah do some casual diving rolls up the stairs and some somersaults if you will. Too bad nobody likes you. <laughs> uh, even though I have one technically on my team. Oh, you guys respond? That's crazy. I'll see you later, though. Okay. Don't hurt yourself. Get back here, back here. Okay, yeah, I was supposed to go to the top of this temple to see, the, see if this braviary was easier to catch off the top of the temple that's flying around. Like the Star Raptor of this region. Well, let's go ahead and head to a camp here and we'll talk to Professor Man and we'll be on our merry way. See, I don't know why the Professor actually can't if I leave these Pokemon in my pasture why the professor can't take up some of these research tasks himself. They're already like, uh, what you call it? Domesticated. So why can't the professor do, you know, pull out these, like, go, just go take out uh, Pokemon and be like, wait, let's go use this move on. You know, probably what I'll do is just run around the Obsidian Field lands, just will be one-shotting all the poor Badoofs and Starlies and Chinxes of the region. To do the move, uh, the move dex requirements. Just go massacre all the, like, level 2 and 3 Pokemon. Miss Kogita. Here you are again. Have you collected all the plates? I think so. Of course, Kirby is a famed member of the Survey Corps after all. So, what more can you tell us? We're so close now, you must know more about the plates. If there's yet more you want to know, kindly bring me wood. Three logs will do. Wood? So you're saying wood is somehow tied to the plates? Well, I suppose that's what we get to learn next. Hop to it, Kirby. Well, it shames me to admit it, merchant that I am. I'm quite out of wood in my stores just now. Do I have any wood? I hope so. Otherwise, we're going to have to do a boring walk down to some forest. Yeah, let's put all this stuff away, I guess. Ooh, we got shiny stone, or dawn stone, some 
Grit gravel, tumblestone to the dust, comet shards I need to sell. No logs, oh logs, oh so you needed three full logs, correct? What else was I looking for? Oh yeah, some of these. It's gonna give Gawain some candy, see if that maybe helped him out a little bit. Oh yeah. Gawain's right up there with us now. Navy, you look like you want some candy. Good stuff. Wayne's right back in it. Right back in the running with the rest of the Pokemon team. Uh, let's walk, maybe. It's hard to play with one hand as I switch my leg. If there's yet more you want to know, kindly bring me wood. Three logs will do. Have you gathered the three logs I requested? Lost one. Here you go. Here's three logs. Oh ho. Yes, this certainly ought to do. She just wanted to start a fire because she was cold, wasn't she? No, the moment comes at last. The big reveal. What, pray tell, is the secret behind this wood? It's for her fireplace. Secret? Your expectations need tempering, I fear. This wood is merely for fashioning myself new cutting boards. Okay. C cutting boards? You mean, for cooking? The plates we are after aren't dinner plates, so this hardly is the time for cooking. How you complain for one shirking his own work this very moment. Poor Ginter of the Ginkgo Guild must have his hands full with you. But honest works, honest work earns honest pay. Here you are, Kirby, a reward for your wood you've brought me. What is it? The pixie plate. Access the fairy type. We were missing a plate. That's one of the plates we were looking for. Uh, ahem, apologies. That's indeed one of the plates that we've been searching for. What do you mean, a plate? Let me see that again. Hmm. This does rather look like one of the plates you've been tracking down. Well, the engravings upon it made it less than accommodating as a cutting board. Whatever ingredients crossed, it certainly gained a more pleasant flavor. Perhaps that was the board's power. The plate's power, power however. Whatever it said kind of skipped it. Well, no more need saying. What do you two intend to do now? Well, we've managed to collect quite a lot of plates by now, but I still don't know what we're to do with them exactly. It's just a hunch, but perhaps we should have a look around the Celestica ruins. Those ruins contain statues of both Dialga and Palkia. They might hold more secrets. They see, a fine pretext to continue shirking your mercantile duties to crawl about in old ruins as you so enjoy. On with you, then. I don't need you to tell me. I'm going. The Celestica ruins, Kirby. I'll see you there. Alright, go on now. To the Celestica ruins. I'm curious myse myself what you'll find there. What can we who live now learn from the remains of our ancient myths and legends? An interesting thought. That's to be sure. So is that all the plates now? That would make what? 17? Let me just do a quick little Ganoogle search. Yes, while we load here. Probably will load faster than Google search. Now. Many Pokemon types are there. 18 Pokemon types. Do I have 18 plates? I thought I only counted 16 last time. Let's have a double recount. We got organized 5, 10, 15, 17. Cool. So what does that leave us? Normal we got fire, water, grass, electric, ice, fighting. 
Got Megan Rothberg. Not that you guys can see it, but I'm bringing it up side by side with my. Capture screen. Just so I can see. We got the normal type. Correct. We got the fire type, the water type, the grass type, electric type, ice of summers here, ice type, fighting type, poison type, earth type, or so, or ground type, yeah, earth plate, ground type. Flying type, psychic, bug, rock, dragon, yard. So we're missing the ghost plate. If such a thing exists, but it should. No ghost plate for us just yet. That is the type we are missing. Interesting. So still a plate to be had somewheres by some Pokemon somewhere along the lake way the way somewhere along the way but guys since we're still missing the plate and there's still mystery to uncover here i think that'll do it for today we came we saw we conquered the snow point temple and regigigas and got a plate from him so i think all in all in the day's work that's good stopping point so I'd like to thank you so much for tuning in. And if you want to help out the channel, I do ask again that you subscribe because it does really help out. And I keep saying that twice. And I do really appreciate it. Especially if you enjoyed today's video. And as we say up here in Canada, peace out.